Hmm. There are a lot of types of invaders that aren't overrated or underrated, so. Hmm. But what game should I play? Hmm. You know what time it is. Cue the intro! Hello Minionators, I'm Andre Terminator and today it's a new episode of Overhated or Underrated. This time with a game that is infamous. As you saw, saw from, from the beginning, you already know what's, what game we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about the curiously, m mostly hated Shadow the Hedgehog. Let's go! Sorry for it. There. There we go. So now you can see the footage. Of course, we're going to play, like I said, Shadow the Hedgehog, which known by many as the worst one of the worst games ever. You want to look Yes. Bang! 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 <laughs> I like that bang sounds. Oh, and by the way, it's been a long time since I played this game, and I still like this game. No joking. But let me see if this game has gotten any better, because well, while I well I have. Played some other game, select mode. I'm gonna use select mode because oh, this is a different load save file. Whoops, wrong save file. Because I have a save file where I beat the where I have already beaten the game, and it's right here. Place it in and pressed on. So sorry for if this video is gonna be really long. So, but. But deal with it. Of course, I'm also going to tackle other PlayStation games that other PlayStation games, and I'm going to show three games up, and then you, and then you, and then you put put. The comment, the one game, one of these three games that has the most comments wins. Which means that you can choose what game I should oh, react to next. I have plenty PlayStation games here, you, so, which you can't see. Let's skip the intro, even though it's badass. Okay, let's go to the game. Select game. <clears throat> As you can see, wait, what? No! Don't tell me I have to play this game all over again. If you ask me why I said that, it's because while I played this game, it took me quite a more longer time to beat it than most people do. do. Alright, you know what? I should see if I could beat this game again because I beat have beat have been beating this game before. Anyway, let's go to a stage. I'm gonna be two stages, which means this one and and another one and a boss. Sorry for the loading times, but it's it's an old PlayStation 2. 
unlike my old PlayStation 2, because that was was broken. It some of the games I have didn't even could not even could not even play be played on that other PlayStation I have, which is right here. So I'm using my brother's PlayStation 2. Okay. I will say one thing, the cutscenes are really nice detail, even though they're using Sonic Heroes Sonic Hero sprites. So I also like the I also like the characters. My favorite video game character is Shadow the Hedgehog after all. So seeing a game based on him was really shocking and by the way this was this game was the first time where I ever where I ever have you know thought of Shadow's backstory because I didn't know shit about his backstory in Sonic Heroes so oh yeah oh yeah many people say also that game is good and some people say it's bad so I probably should play that game as well but Right now, I'm going to be the stage from Sonic Heroes. But it's from Shadow the Hedgehog, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, alright then. Start with the first stage. Oh. Damn it, it's that stage. My least favorite stage is right there, because you have to find a, some kind of special robot. Lost Impact. Oh, by the way, if I'm reading this wrong, put it in the comments. But maybe should put it, this place in, you know what? Why do I do, do this one? Yeah, that was Maria. This was the first time where I actually heard of her. So, you know what, I'm not gonna do that stage. You know what, I just pick a stage from the select, the state, the state, the stage. The stage selection, state, stage selection, stage selection. Okay, let me see. The first stage I'm gonna do is this one, which is West Opolis. And if I, by the way, if you put in the comments if I'm reading this wrong. Stage 1. West Opolis. Oh, this video is actually long. 7 minutes already. I mean, look down there. Oh, now it started. Okay, so in this game, there's guns, and I'm gonna do the Sonic. And of course, the spin dash makes a return, but many people say it's it's critically bad because in this game you have to sta be standing still. But those people are—I think those people are dumb. I mean. In the other games, like the first, cla in the classic games, you also have to stand still in order to use the spin dash. It's, they just, do, they just decide to, you know, use the original Sonic design. In this case, the spin dash from Sonic, from Sonic 2. In this case, the classic game. And in that game, they used, well, the spin dash with standing still positions. And that's Black Doom, and I hate him. And of course, I'm gonna show that those creatures, like Sonic says, that they mean business. Of course, many people say that the gunplay is bad, but I think it's kind of fun to use 
to use gunplay. I mean, it's it should not be there, but it's fun fun when you think about it. I especially like those pistols right there because they're looking so. And by the way, here's another thing that they that this game actually do something good about, and that's and that's the ring system. Now you're no longer losing. In the original games, you're losing all of your rings if you get hit. But here, you're losing few rings than before, which means that you can easily. So you can easily not get killed that fast. Which. Okay, I died, but. What? I should. But. No, let's just beat this game. In this case, just going from. The other thing is that the controls are actually good. They are decent. Unlike another game I once played. Sorry. Yeah, there's and also there's a special meter thing. When you kill kill evil, you're getting you you're putting you Okay, that okay, I just died there. But I just show you how to play the game. I'm not trying to, you know. And no, I'm not going to do a sorry again. Oh, by the way, it is quite a hard to beat this game without using guns or something like that because, well... As you can see, I get really it pretty much hit. Which is why I'm using guns most of the time. Also, the, the mechanics do work. Because one thing, the ring system. Look! Instant! Okay. I know it was first introduced into Sonic, Sonic, Sonic Adventure 2, which one day I will make a overhead or underrated thing, because many people, because many people have been, have been criticizing it for being bad, which I think is bullshit. And if you know, and if you, and if you want to know. That's why I'm gonna make the video. Sorry! You're in my way, dicks! Okay, now I'm- okay, sorry. I'm sorry for that language, but... There's also cursing in Shadow the Hedgehog. And no, they're not- They're- <sighs> I think- I think- I think just like Fawful's minion, who- who stated that he- find that many people criticize the cursing way too much. I mean, in some ways they're funny, like, where's that damn fourth chaos emerald kind of funny. Also, there's also this out damn you There's also this Also there's also plenty of time for speed. So there's that. I just don't hope this video is getting too long. Of course I'm gonna use a vehicle which is in here. There's a there's a vehicle up here. Of course I collected all the keys. Oh wait, no I didn't. So I'm gonna use this one. <clears throat> I was, oh yeah, by the way, I also like the driving mechanics because driving mechanics are actually are pretty good in this game. Even though that they do have a for example they have their own health bar. So you have to be Of course, look! I'm driving! I'm playing this to be! Of course, I'm gonna, just gonna beat the stage and then I... Oh yeah, 
yeah, here's a here's a strong attack. This is Chaos Blast. I'm just going to show you that. Again. Anyway, let me print, say my thoughts on the game. Even though I didn't do Normal mission completed. Now it's time for my my thoughts. Anyway, so is this game really that bad when you when you see it as its own game? No. Absolutely not. It's actually a good game if you're looking at the right way as the way as I do. And you know me as a guy who mostly is positive. I'm not that negative. I mean, there's a reason why I like this game. It's the second Sonic game that I actually played. Okay, if you count Sonic CD, that's the third Sonic game I played. And it's actually a good game if you're looking at the right ways, as I do. Which... I clearly do. So, without further ado, this game gets the score of underrated. Well, next time you will see me play Sonic Heroes. And then next time, well, next time I'm going to do something called You Choose For Me. Which is where you, you, let me see if. Let's see if there's a game there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I have three games right here. And many people say they're bad. They it's and also and this is you choose decision, even though I don't know if any's gonna choose a decision, but okay. <clears throat> there's either Sonic Riders. Sonic Worms 3D. I don't know if many people criticize for has that split personality right there. Anyway, or Sonic Unleashed. You're choosing in the comments, and then I'll say who's the winner. So, without further ado, I'm Andrea Terminator, and Q, and I'll see you next time, Mininators. And now, the end credits.